Hello fellow developers, are you ready to dive into the exciting world of Expo React Native? Today we are going to set up our Expo React Native app and get it up and running in no time. Before we begin, make sure you have Expo CLI installed on your machine. If you haven't installed it yet, you can do so by running the following command. First thing first, let's create our Expo project open up the terminal and run the following command make sure to select TypeScript with the blank template Next, install the dependencies by running npm install to install the project dependencies. Once that is done, configure the tsconfig file in the project root directory. Once we open the tsconfig.json file, update it with the TypeScript compiler options provided in this tutorial. You can also find it on my GitHub in the description below. This configuration ensures TypeScript compatibility in our Expo project. Okay, that's done. Install additional TypeScript dependencies by running the following command in your terminal. Once that is done, install Jest dependencies to set up Jest for testing by running the following command in your terminal. These packages provide these packages provide the necessary tools and configuration for running tests in Expo React Native projects. Configure the jest.config.js file in the project root directory. This configuration ensures proper integration of Jest with Expo React Native project. Now let's create a new mockup file in the root directory of our project by adding the following code. This file serves as a mock for the static file import in just test. Next, run the following command to install the testing library that provides 
powerful and convenient methods for testing React Native components. Run this command as well. Last but not least, update package.json file and add the following line to the script section. This script allows us to run tests using the command npm test. Now, let's create a sample test file. Add the following code snippets to the test file. This test file verifies that the app component renders correctly in our Expo React Native project. Now we have an error because the test do not match what is rendering on the app.css so all we need to do is to copy this test here and put it here. Now our test is passing. And there you have it, you have successfully set up your Expo React Native app with testing capabilities. That concludes the tutorial on setting up Expo React Native. I hope you find it very helpful in getting started with your development journey. If you have any question, feel free to leave it them in the comment below. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel for more exciting tutorials and hit that notification bell to stay updated. Until next time, happy coding!